Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Boston, Massachusetts with the fraudster known as Mass Accountability, a.k.a. PayPal Tommy, as he is booted off of uh, a state piece of property and, uh, well, turns into a giant man-child baby kind of thing. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Excuse me? Who are you? Who are you? I was just looking over there. Oh, okay. For who? Who do you work for? Don't ask me questions. Why can you ask me questions, but I can't ask you questions? I work for myself. Who do you work for? The state? I work for myself. Oh, okay. That lanyard says something different. You came up to me, ma'am. You approached me, and that's why I record everything. What'd you say? You'll take care of me? Is that what you said? Jelly beans. This is the moron behind the camera. Mass accountability. Or as some people call him, uh, PayPal Tommy because, well, he goes around and uh, e-begs quite frequently. Because as you can tell from his award-winning personality right here, he wouldn't be able to hold a job even if he had one, because who the hell would hire a man with this kind of attitude problem? Sir. What? The Says who? Where's the sign? This is, this is, this is, this is, this is, pu this is public property. Yes, it is. It's state public, it's state property. Yes, it is. State troopers, this is, this is not your jurisdiction. I'm here for this place. This, this state, okay, this is state jurisdiction. Sidewalk. You need to call the state police. I'm not calling the yeah, state Yeah, this is the Sir, state, I no. Need you onto the sidewalk. Or what? Are you going to arrest me? It will be for trespass, yes. On state property, on public property. This is no law. You better call a sergeant. I am. Call public. a sergeant. This is state property. There's no signs. Bravo, take five, five. That is off, to, off uh, for pr public property. That should have been on when you got out of your car. I'm not refusing to leave. Oh, just like any other frauditor, he has a sense of entitlement and believes that, well, the trespassing laws don't apply to him or they don't exist at all. Well, uh, boy, they certainly do exist and they certainly do apply to you. You were asked to leave. And, well, if you don't leave, you'll be trespassed and arrested. I wonder if that's going to happen to this idiot today. Let's find out. I'm stating you have no jurisdiction on state... Are you at the uh, shelter at 120? Correct. Correct. Okay, can I get a Bravo PFD? This is state property, and we are allowed to be here. We are not allowed to be in the building. Yeah, you know that's not right. State police know what's up. If they want, they have to put up signs saying, uh, this is not open to public anymore because this is public property. There's not one sign saying public can't. For us to read the signs, we have to walk up to the door. Like you could even read it all. Because you know what? I find that the ability for frauditors to uh, read and properly understand anything is... Well, quite lacking in a lot of instances. Uh, it's either cherry picking or failure to comprehend or something along those lines. It, it's abysmal that they have such a low education. I mean, come on now, do do better. Hello? Okay. I have one guy here refusing to leave. I'm not refusing to leave. I Actual time. I'm, I'm not, not refusing to leave. Okay, and I'm done with you. Your actions speak much louder than your words ever could. You say you're not refusing to leave, but 
Look at what you're doing. You're refusing to walk away from this situation and acting like a complete moron. I mean, what do you call that? I would call that refusing to leave. But you know what? He's an uneducated frauditor who just, well, can't comprehend simple concepts like that. It's state property. What's your sergeant's name? What's your name and badge number? Last name Dapina, badge number 5386. Dapina 5386? Correct. And you were told you you are here to trespass people off this property? That's why you're here? I'm here for their safety. Okay, and what am I? I'm not here for ill will. Look, I'm not I'm here to not hurt anyone. I'm back and forth with you. I already told you, but you seem to know what you're yeah, talking about. I do. About. So I absolutely know what I'm talking I'm about. I'm removing myself from your situation. Okay. And you asked for patrol supervisor. Yeah, I did. On the way. Yes, I did. Oh, frauditor, you know what you're talking about. Uh, well, uh, citation needed, please, because a lot of times whenever a frauditor says they know things, uh, yeah, I tend to be really doubtful because you guys tend to lie as if it's as easy as drinking water from a fountain. I mean, it just comes naturally to you guys. No, they're already here, and uh, the the supervisor's coming right now. They're trying to say this isn't state, state property, and uh, they're trying to tell me I can't be here. Yes, sir. Did your parents have any children that live? Sir, yes, sir. I bet they regret that. Are you a director here or something, sir? I'm an operations supervisor. Is this not state property? This is state property. This is state property. You have no jurisdiction on state property. You cannot be here. I you can, be, I can be on the property. I can't you be cannot. inside. You cannot. Says what law? It's the state property. Which is funded not. funded by who? The public. I'm not going to engage in the conversation. It's, it's funded by the public. Therefore, if there's an authorized personnel only... Dude. All you have to do is take a look at the trespassing statute and realize that, well, you are really, really way off base, dude. I mean, all they have to do is ask you to leave, and if you don't leave, that's trespassing. But I guess that's just way over your head. I'm not going to change anything. Why am I here? here? I'm yeah. here to see if you guys are going to respect our right to film this going on, which is major public okay, interest. You, and I thought you could do and it I, the south. I could do it on state you. property, too. I could do you it on what? state property, too. I'm done having a conversation. Yeah, because you know you're not going to win. I don't need to win. It's not the losing battle. It is. You're on the wrong side of history. <clears throat> then you should do your history. Yeah, you know who the last people were to just follow orders? You know who that was? Oh, false equivalence fallacy right out of the ass right here. So you're wanting to compare what the Nazis did as to the Jews and the rest of Europe to uh, trespassing? I mean, come on now, dude. I mean, apples to oranges, false equivalency. Ever heard of that kind of thing? I guess not, because you're too busy trying to come up with uh, various other fallacies that fit your little narrative, right? How are you? Yeah, how are you? All right. I mean, we have multiple press up meetings today, multiple press up meetings. Do me a favor, just stay up. Uh, I can, I can be right here, yeah, that's fine. Okay. That's I fine. I can be on the public sidewalk, but I'm having a conversation fine. with her, and I don't need you to hear. That's so fine. I don't have to stay back. It's not a law. Yes, you do. No, it's not a yes, law. You do. It's not a law, sir. Falling as I'm going to show you that it's a law. For what? Okay. What? Next What's the law? Right there. What is I the need law? Some privacy to talk to my officer. Okay? okay. You can't be interrupting me. I'm doing. I'm not life. interrupting. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Me. Interference is a physical okay. act. Do you use that on everybody, dude? Because interference does not have to be a physical act. I mean, for example. If you're at a traffic stop, filming a traffic stop, and you start uh, screaming at the cop because you don't like his boots or something like that, and he has to pay attention to you and he ends up getting hurt as a result of that, well, that falls on you. You interfered by 
drawing his attention away from a situation and leading to a further escalation that could have been prevented had you not been such an asshole. You understand? Can I get your name, name, name badge number? Right? No, I don't understand that. You don't understand? No, that? I don't well, understand. I'm that. telling you that right now. Okay? That's, that's not true. Okay. It's well, not a lot. Property after it, I've it's been not a, That's not your jurisdiction. That's, that's not your state property. property. Go ahead that, and that's step not yet. All right. So I can't it's, cut through to the parking back. You cannot step in our property. Where's the property lines? There. Wait a second. Do you see what I see? I see something in your video, PayPal, Tommy, that maybe you should have kept out because you were talking about how there were no signs telling you not to be on that property. Well, maybe this particular sign right here should have been a clue, but I guess you just. Well, uh, thought that would be inconvenient, right? Where okay. are the property lines? You can walk in the public side Where are all up and down if you want. Where are the property lines I can't go, go to? Into that what about line? up here on the sidewalk? What about up there? You already know. You no, I don't. No, I don't. Well, then, I'm telling you. What's your name you, and badge number? My name is Sergeant DePina. My badge is right here. Oh, you're, you're both DePina? Yes, Yes. Okay, correct. are you related? That's no, not your problem. Yeah, it is my problem. Yeah, it is. All you need to know is right now, you can record all you want. That's state property. Sidewalk. The state police need to tell me. Yes, that. I'm not going to tell you. Yeah, That's okay. All said. right. So what? Are you going to arrest me if I walk back on the yes, property? Yes, I will. You will? Yes. For what? For what? Yes. So, so because I'm exercising my First Amendment right? On that property, we're just going to place them under arrest. You're going to arrest me because I'm, I'm exercising my First Amendment right? Recording on a public property? Not, on the public. That's public right. too. That's state public. property is public, That's sir. Public. Yes, it is. Frauditors have got to be some of the most brain-dead people on the planet. I mean, it's a simple concept that even state property is subject to laws of trespassing, and yet the, this particular moron and, uh, just doesn't seem to get it through his, well, uh, empty skull that this is the case. But seeing as how he probably never even graduated elementary school, I guess uh, it's understandable why he's this stamp stupid. Step State property. Okay. All right. Step on it and find okay. out. Okay. All right. You want to do it? Yes. You do? Let's do it. Oh, you do? You do want to do it? That's what you want to do? Is arrest somebody? That breaks the law, yeah. That's not breaking the law. It it's you. not breaking the law. Well, how do you know that? How do I know that? Because well, I know that State property. Apparently you don't know. It's it. State property funded by the taxpayers. That's all public property. The only thing we cannot go into is inside. I told you, it's the only thing we can go not do like is this. where. No, there's no public access to where? vehicles and anybody else. Where? It's close to right on that where? Door. Authorized personnel. Authorized vehicles. I'm not a vehicle. Yeah, and you can. I can't go sit at the bench on the public bench. What business do you have to conduct it? I'm, I'm exercising my First Amendment. When you have a legitimate this is legitimate business. It's a matter of public interest. A matter of public business, huh? Well, excuse me while I do this right quick. <laughs> oh, wait, you serious? Let me laugh even harder. <laughs> I can do it from there as well. I can do it from there as well. Are those benches not public? 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 I do. I do. I do. I do. Filming is legitimate business. Well, go in there and start filming then. All right. Not inside. Inside is off limits. Inside is off limits. No. No. You're just so wrong here, sir. D575. You're so wrong here, sir. What? Stop coming up to my cruiser and harassing me while I'm. I'm not stop. harassing you. That's another. Filming is not harassment. You're you so wrong. I need somebody above you. I can. I can. No, you can't. Yes, I can. No, you can't. What law is that? You cannot. What law is that? Come on now, for auditor. Even if he told you what the law is or anything like that, uh, you would say it's unconstitutional. Even though, well, most of the time, if a law is unconstitutional, it's going to be taken care of. But you morons don't seem to be able to comprehend that either. Because there's private information. That then you have to that protect that. To. Then you have it to cover that. By me telling you to stay away. No, not a, no, 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 no. Okay. That's not true. 
If you look in my vehicle and you see something, does that mean you can't do that? No, that's not true. There is no private information in the vehicle that I'm Yes, there is. Yes, there is. When we have stuff in our... Keep it in there open, then you leave it open. Exactly. That's the point. I'm a police officer. It doesn't matter. You have no special privileges or rights. That's not a special privilege. Yes, it is. Well, just step up to the window and stop filming inside then. Wow, you're a tyrant, dude. You're going you're gonna to get me for swearing, too? Look at you vi rights violators, tyrants, the Dupinas. You guys are going to get a lot of calls on this one. Okay, thank you. Okay, you guys don't give a shit. No. No, you, you don't. Have a job. Same as no, you you're not. You're okay, not doing your job. Yeah, Protecting my rights is doing my job. Is doing your job. Protecting their rights is also my job. Who, the illegal migrants? Well, I'm just going to cut him off right there because, well, he is a butt hurt freaking moron who is upset that the officers didn't bow down and lick his boots. Oh, poor little uh, man child. Why don't you go home and uh, crawl into your bed and, uh, well, try yourself to sleep tonight with your favorite pillow. Oh, poor little man, baby. You Do you want your bottle? And your favorite book to read so you can rock yourself to sleep tonight? Oh, pathetic. So at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. And I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?